In this short video, I'll show you how to create a modern calligraphy style of hand lettering that's great for just about any project. This style of fake calligraphy is really easy to do. You basically need to know one simple trick. So here's how we do it. Start with your best cursive hand lettering. I do mine in pencil and then go over it in pen. Then what we're going to do is thicken each down stroke. So everywhere that you're pulling the pen towards your body, that's where you thicken the letters. Once you've done that, you're just going to fill in those areas that you've made. You don't have to, but that's kind of what gives it that faux calligraphy look. And that's all there is to it. Let's do another example together. I've written the word love. Then I'm going to thicken each letter wherever I pull the pen towards my body. So when you write the letter L, your pen goes up and then back down. And that's the part that you want to thicken. Let's do another example together. I'm going to write the word may in pencil. So just trying my best to get a good cursive and then I'll thicken each letter on the down stroke. Then I go over it in pen. I'm using my 05 Pigma Micron nib and I'm just going carefully around that. And in this example, I am making sure to leave those thick down strokes completely open, so no lines going through them. That way I can color them in and do something interesting, like a little bit of line shading, or you could put an alternative color here, have a bit of fun with it. Um, and I think that looks really pretty. For my final practice example, I'm going to use a marker, but the idea is completely the same. I'm doing my best cursive, and then I am just thickening those letters wherever the pen is moving down to the bottom of the page toward me. And that's it. This folligraphy or modern calligraphy hand lettering style is great for greeting cards and just about anything where you need a cute handmade font. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you soon with a new video.